Hey everybody, and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. It's the artist known as Andrew speaking, and it's time for another scam call. I get this one every now and then, but I love it when they call. This is the AT&T and DirecTV scammers. They call about your account. They want to offer you a special deal, maybe $50 off a month for a whole year, and all you got to do is pay a $1.99 fee up front. Fantastic! I've never had AT&T. I've never had DirecTV have never had those. The address and phone number and everything that he has, none of it's valid. And that's okay. I love screwing with them. The best part is, there should be a part two. There should be a follow-up to this one. You'll see why. But I had such a great time screwing with this guy. Love it. Hope you all enjoy. And remember, if you ever get calls like this, especially from a company or a cable provider or something similar to this that you don't do business with, and you know you've never done business with them, just hang up on them or screw with them like I do. But, hey, at least they're calling and at least they're trying. I give them that. Love wasting their time. Enjoy. Good, thank you. Welcome. Uh, sir, you are using AT&T DirecTV at your place. That's why we are calling you. Okay. Actually, sir, the reason of this call today do you remember that last year we talked to you from the promotion department and we gave you a promotion on your AT&T DirecTV bill for the one year? And on that time we promised with you when your promotion will expire, we will call you back to renew the promotion. Oh, okay. So this month your per so okay and so this month sir your promotion is expired so we are calling you back to renew the promotion because we don't want to surprise you with a high bill next month okay? well, I, I appreciate and that here, okay and here i can see that sir your 50 dollar discount just expired this month and after expiry of the 50 dollar discount your bill increased by 50 dollar but you don't need to be worried. I will try to give you the same $50 once again on your bill. But first I need to check into my system how much is available this time. Is it is it possible to do more than 50 for this for this time? Uh, I, uh, I need to check in my oh, system. Oh, okay. Just give me a moment, sir. I mean 75, 80, that would be, that'd be great. But I'm not pushing it. Uh, I'm not pushing just, it. Just... Just give me a moment. Okay. I'm just checking. Okay. And I will try to uh, give you the same. Okay. Just. Or better. The same or better, right? And 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 do you remember how much you pay your last bill? I I honestly don't know. I like I said before, um, it's auto debited out of my 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 debit account every month. So I I actually okay. never see the bill. I I just know okay. it's paid. And please. Okay, please verify me your four-digit PIN code, like a passcode on your account. Uh, six like one, one two. It's six one two eight. Six one two eight. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Okay. okay, and sir, can you please grab a pen and paper? I would like to share some basic information with you, like my name, my ID number, and the callback number. Sure, sure. I'm ready. I've got a pen. First of all, write it down, my name. My name is Michael. Michael, okay. And now please write it down, my employee ID number. Okay. My employee ID is 8012JR, like junior. Okay. I got and it. And also please, uh, yeah, thank you. And also please... Write it down the direct line number of the promotion department of Direct TV 808 808 800 Okay. All right, I got it. Okay, this is the direct line number of the promotion department. If you get a high bill next month, you can directly call us back on this number and we will help you. But I will make sure you will not get a high bill and I will make it uh, cheaper once again. Just give me a moment. Okay. I'm looking for the best available promotion. And do you have any active email address where we can send you the email regarding to this promotion into the written form? 
Well, I don't use email very much, but I do have uh, an email with my old account. It's H-E-L-L <laughs> at gmail.com. There you go. Okay, this is not? I think that's the old one, that yeah. The, okay, so you will also get the email regarding to this promotion into the written form. Okay. And you also, we also send you the email regarding to the expiry of the promotion. Okay, and uh, now just give me a moment. Okay. Okay, I am just looking at your bills. Okay. What was the last bill amount? Do you do you see that? Uh, let me check. And okay. please, sir, give me an alternate number, your home phone number, in case we cannot reach you back on this number. We need to attach an alternate number on the file. Well, I only have the one number. I don't have a home phone. I just have this number. This is the only number uh, like, I have. Do you have, do you have a cell phone number? That's what this is. Uh, any other cell phone number? No, I only have one cell phone. Okay, you just have this. You number. you can you can list this number twice if 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 need be. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And by the way, sir, are you happy with our reception and uh, with the programming lineup? Oh yeah, I've I've got no problem with it. it works for me. I wonder That's why great. that was so funny. That was a weird. Weird reaction to me telling him I only have one number. Ha, ha, ha. Weird. Okay, so here I have a good news for you. I can see you have three TVs with us. You have one yep. main receiver and two mini receiver boxes. Yep, that's correct. And your service address is 331 Jacksonville, Florida, 32216. Yes, yes. Okay. And uh, can you please verify me the name on the account? Timothy Williams. Sorry, can you repeat that? Timothy Williams. Timothy Williams? Mm-hmm. Okay. Do you have a different name? Thank you. Uh, no, no. Actually, I'm just uh, verifying this account that I am talking to the right person. I am talking okay. to the account holder. Yeah, I think because last time, last time I I yeah. dealt with with the promotions department from AT and T, they had my ex wife's name, which she no longer pays the bill. I I paid the bill, not her. So I told them to remove uh, her what? name from the file, and hopefully uh, they did that. Uh, what's your wife's name? Jennifer. Okay, just give me a moment. Okay. Yes, it's uh, Jennifer no. Castero, uh, Castro no. John Parra. No, 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 no. That's my ex-wife. We've been divorced for many years. I don't want her name associated with any of these accounts. She doesn't pay oh, okay. any of these bills. I told them last okay. time they called. Okay, what is your first name? Timothy. Uh, I'm the one that pays the bill. T-I-M-O-T-H-Y. Yes, I'm the one that pays the bills, not her. O-T-H-Y. Okay, T-I-M-O-T-H-Y. Timothy. Yeah, that crazy Jennifer woman, that crazy woman. T-I-R. No, no, my name's, my last name, Williams. That was her last name. Yes, yes, yes. So I can remove this name from Please. the account? Please, Please do. I... Okay, I'm really sorry. It really, it, it like upsets my whole day when I hear her name. I hate so even really saying sorry. it. You know what I mean? I, that woman I, abused I, me yes, so yes. much. I don't want anything to do with her. You have to realize, I, really sorry, I, I was in yes, a, I was I in can. an abusive relationship. You know, it wasn't oh, a lot I'm of physical really abuse. I mean, that was that was the physical abuse was okay. I mean, it was kind of kinky, but uh, the mental abuse. Oh, oh my yeah. God, the mental abuse. You have no idea. You want to hear something oh, crazy? Really sorry, you want to hear something crazy? I'm really she made I'm me. Really sorry, yeah. She made me live with my mother-in-law. Do you believe and that? Sir, I can. Uh, uh, oh. I can see that this this number is uh, not associated to uh, the account as well. Nine zero four eight nine. Well, that's my so number. I mean, please. that's the number you called. Yes. Yes. 
Yes, yes, but that is not associated to your account. If you don't remember your account number, you can use your uh, phone number to uh, like find your account for the DirecTV. But that number is not associated. Maybe well, your then, wife number is associated. Well, then why account, did you right? call? Then why did you call that number then? If it's not associated with the account you're calling on, sir, we have this number on the file on the account. Right, right that's my number. This number is not. Okay, but this number is not associated with the account. Like uh, uh, your wife's na number is, I uh, I think that is still on the account. Am well, right? take it off. Absolutely, take it off. The last thing I want is for you to call her about a bill that she doesn't okay. even pay. Can you give uh, Can you give me her number? I don't that know what it is anymore. I have number? I have erased it from my memory. I don't have a clue what that number is. I don't ever call it. I have no intention of calling it. Okay. You feel free. Okay, and the complete, feel free to call okay, it yourself, I, but I'm not doing it. Okay, and the complete number is 331-546. Am I right? Yes. It's Jacksonville, Florida, 32216. Yes. Okay, so I have a good news for you, Mr. Timothy. Okay. I removed your wife's uh, name from the account Thank successfully. Thank you. Thank you. And uh, we have one more good news for you. Okay. We can give you a same $50 discount once again on your bill. And this time, $50 discount will be good for the two year instead of one year. Oh, uh, okay. It sounds to you. Hey, is there and any we'll way... Keep it in, is there any way you could we'll, make it... Is there any way you could make it one year and make it a hundred dollars for a year uh sir no this is not possible oh. uh we can give you the same 50 for the next two more year and please keep it in mind this is not any kind of promotion uh, this is not any kind of contract okay this is just a promotion that we are giving you for the next two year okay, okay. perfect perfect well i appreciate the call michael saving me money it's a wonderful thing Yes, yes, just give me a moment. Okay. Okay. And uh, uh, Mr. Timothy, do you remember that last year when you got that $50 discount on your bill? Mm -hmm. Just for the one year on that time, how much you pay the one time sign up and the promotion fee to get this promotion on your bill? I have no idea. I don't remember what it was at all. I'm really sorry. Let me go and check into my system. Okay. Okay, so here I can see Mr. Timothy. Uh, Mr. Timothy, what is your middle initial name? E. E for Eugene. E as, uh, e as an echo? Yes. E as an echo, E as an elephant. Well, actually, it's E as in Eugene, but okay. That works. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, so sir, here I can see that last year when you got that $50 discount on your bill, just for the one year, on that time you paid a one-time sign-up and the promotion fee to get this promotion on your account. That okay. was $199.99. Mm. But sir, this time company giving you the same $50 discount for the two year instead of one year, and your one-time promotion fee will be same as last year. One hundred ninety-nine dollar and ninety-nine cent. Okay. And to compensate this one-time fee, we are giving you a twenty-dollar additional discount this time. So, with the help of this twenty-dollar additional discount, your total discount will be seventy dollar, and uh, your bill will be seventy dollar cheaper every month for the next two years. How does it sound to you? That sounds great. That sounds great. Now, are you able to go ahead and, and just uh, build and, build the and account like normal? Have just give me a moment. And Mr. Timothy, we also have senior citizens uh, promotions going on. Can you please tell me how old you are? Well, I'm not a senior citizen, so... Uh, how old you are? I don't want to say. I'm not a senior oh, okay. citizen, though. Okay, okay. You are... Um, by the way, how, is, uh, how old you are? You are just 63 years old? Michael, what part of I don't want to say did you not understand? Okay, I can understand. Do you want to, do you want to ask me again just to make sure? I am really sorry. I'm very really sorry. Okay. You should be. 
So are you able to just to bill the account like normal for that one ninety nine? Just give me a moment. Okay. Or do I have to pay it up front? That's the important part. I am, I am checking. I'm checking. Just give me. Yeah, because because I, I, to like be I honest with you, that. we're less than a week away from uh, Christmas, and all my extra money is going towards Christmas, so I don't have a hundred ninety nine dollars on me right this second. Probably won't be after the first of the year before I have any extra money. So if you can add it to my bill, that's fine. Actually, that promotion will expire before 31st. Uh, the last day is 31st of December. And uh, if you we didn't apply that promotion and your bill once generated, then we will not uh, able to apply that promotion. And that is required by the automatic system. So here I can see that you need to clear that payment before 31st of December to get this $70 promotion on the bill for the two more year. So what do you want to do now? Well, I don't have $200 to pay right this second, so is there any possible way you guys can call me back closer to the 31st? And Once Christmas is over, I'll probably have some money left over, but right now yeah, I don't. Like you know what I mean? Okay, just give me a moment. I mean, Let if me you guys could, to my supervisor and yeah, if you guys could her, call uh, me back, call me back next week after Christmas. That that'd be probably be the best thing to do. Okay. okay. And uh, how much you can afford easily today? Nothing. I don't have anything extra at this moment. I am tapped okay. out. We just we just had a family Christmas party yesterday, and I gave all the kids in the family a little bit of money, and I don't have anything left for myself. Okay, I got that. It's ramen noodles and hot water for at least the next week. Okay, I got that. I'll be lucky if it's hot water. As long as the as long as the microwave works, I'll be good. Otherwise, okay. it's crunchy ramen. You ever had crunchy ramen? It's not good. Ugh. Okay, so uh, we can call you back after the 25, after the Christmas, okay. and then we will submit this promotion on your account. Perfect. Right now, we are not going to apply that promotion, okay? All right, well, as long as we can get it done before the 31st, right? That's that's the goal, right? Uh, yes, 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 the last day is 31st, and I will give you the call before that. You don't need to be worried. That sounds great. All right, Michael, I appreciate it. Thank you so much for calling me, okay? Okay, sir. Thank you so much. You have a good day. Take care. Bye-bye. You too. Bye-bye. That's all right. He's done. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> Just like hang up, he says something. That's so funny. Anyway, I've, I've spoken to a lot of Michaels before. Who knows if that's one I've spoken to before, but that was hilarious. Guys, I don't have AT&T. I have never had AT&T direct TV. Ever. So the fact that they're calling about a promotion, I obviously never have had. Is wonderful. Love it. Can't wait for them to call back. Hey everybody, and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.